welcome to round one of the 2023 Rugby Europe Championship. We bring you tonight's fixture from the beautiful Stadio de Jamor in Lisbon. And it sees a rejuvenated Portugal side, fresh from qualifying for the upcoming Rugby World Cup. Their host last year's trophy winners, Belgium. Welcome to round one of the 2023 Rugby Europe Championship as Portugal hosts Belgium at Estadio de Jamor in their capital city, Lisbon. They go back to the inside to Portugal. Great ball to Marta, Rodrigo Marta. Sniping run from the wing three quarter, but it's still there. They pick it up and go for the line. Vincent Pinto has the first say inside the opening five minutes, and it's Portugal, Os Lobos, that get on the board first and start off their campaign. Look, to, they almost mess it up. Could have gone to hand, but the scrambling Belgian defence unfortunately doesn't connect and gives an easy run through for the score. Good take from the experienced flop, Geronimo Portela, the 22 year old. He has been absolutely fantastic for Portugal. Try. A little bit too leaky that defence for me. No, it's not for me. I think it was no. Lima managed to just get a fend and sneak through on this near side. Uh, and then it was just a straightforward put away for the winger. Again, excellent work saving a certain try. Their back three working well in tandem. We saw Jose Lima and Vincent Pintu for the Portuguese side. Dangerous, this ball's loose. It's scooped up. Very close to line, rolling Final. over. Nicolas Martins, we're going to check to see how this looks. Just want to check, no knock on. Going to need a replay. And then frame a try. For right. sure, to know what's going on there. Perfect. It's been given. Not sure where that ball sped out from. That's, those are the ones that kind of hurt after they scramble, as you say. Managed to regain possession for a portion of that play, Belgium, but then lost it again. Yeah, Nicolas Martins scooping on it, just keeping the pressure on. Get They get their third try already. Hard work by the big forwards. Very close to the try line. Portugal knocking on the door. And Madeira picks and drives. They've done really well to work their way up the field. Portela to the outside. And now numbers are plenty. And to finish in the end, Jose Lima scores the fourth try for Portugal, and they're looking fabulous. Yeah, pretty good execution of a huge overlap there. Uh, suspicion of a full pass, potentially, as they finish that one off, but, but obviously not. Kicks to go deep yet again. The magic feet into play with a good left footed step. Zagetch has been held, and Belgium get this one over the top. The defense holds strong after a long aerial battle. Here at the Stadio de Jamont Stadium, it's a nice high kick. It's for Belgium. Yeah, great kick indeed. Florian Remu getting it done in the outside center. <laughs> Looping around now, Baudry. Big drive from him. Back to the left hand side where. The pack was set. It's a nice ball over the top of the corner, reaching for the line there. there. What a score! That is outstanding from this Belgium outfit. They whip it wide. The timing was right. And they have their first try in this competition. A brilliant bit of effort is a scorch in the corner. They may just clear their lines here. A lot of defenders in front. So they go downfield. Belgium is there with Desi Cornet. This one finally goes out of bounds, and that is the half-time whistle. Okay. Half-time score, 26 points to yep. 10. Portugal yes. lead Belgium here it's okay. at the Honor Stadium in Lisbon. Here we go, okay. second half. We're off and running in this Rugby Europe Championship opening weekend for 2023. Second half begins between Portugal and Belgium from the coastal capital of Lisbon. Red attack. Geronimo Portela again at a standing start. We've got such dangerous players out wide to this Portuguese side. One of them in ball in hand right now. Rodrigo Marta cuts through. Brilliant bit of work. He's picked three or four. 
offloads superbly and following up is a scrum of Juan Bellu. It's a lightning strike in Lisbon and Portugal score one of their best tries this evening. Yeah, that was nice. Well finished off. And lovely follow-up play. There's a few players from Portugal there sniffing a try. Probably feel like this might be a game where there'd be some in the offing and people with fresh legs coming out for the second half fancied it. But it was a scrum half. Portela throws it back in yet again. Penalty in the quick tap from Portugal to go up. Not 10 metres. And again, they go straight up the middle. Pedro Lukas looking for support. It's a great ball over the top. It's still there. It's available. The one-handed flick over the line. They go. Skills on display. And Nuno Souza Getch finishes it off. That was a thrilling bit of rugby from Portugal. That's the second try they've scored this half in, in similar fashion where they're able to just get those final passes, final offloads away. Oh, almost stripped them out of the hands of Gibel Andrade down to the short side. Appleton, good, clean hands as they cut back in. Working in there is Vincent Pintu. And now down the fringes they work. Oh, catching everybody by surprise. Pedro Lukas springs up at the right time at the right place an easy run in in the end a few meters to go down the short side and see is absolutely no one someone coming in late to fill in but they're all folding to the open side which left an easy run They've got a bit of a track record with penalties and he's always liable to give i mean your back pros always are i guess aren't they but that's going to be tough always to aggressive now. Yeah, playing on the edge, here come Portugal now, driving that ball. Haven't seen this from them all day, but they get over the line and they score the try. It's well worked in the end from Portugal. And their forward pack, and it's Lionel Tampere that scores his second try for his country. Kind of play in a diverse fashion here. And they got firepower across the side. Go to the right. To Matteo Rifon, the 21 year old. No gap for him. And there's a dummy there, and the short ball's a good one as they have it for the line. Ball spits free. It's picked up and dive over. It will be a score. It's a brilliant finish in the end. Really nice. A little bit loose sometimes with the wide out runners, but <clears throat> intent to carry through. Now, a lovely little offload there. That one, didn't know if it needed it. Thought maybe he was already over the line, but fortunately went backwards and scooped up for the score. Bedinia, and his 11th cap for his country. Portela again the inside ball they use it to great effect ball will stay with them always threatening with ball in hand and that is the full-time whistle it's a perfect start for Portugal to their rugby Europe championship campaign and they score eight tries and tonight they'll lift the Colton Cup who was on the line in this rivalry crash a big score for them in the end 54 points to 17 Portugal defeat Belgium